everyone, Tiz here from Chisel Fitness. Just wanted to do a wee video today, touching on a wee topic that um, I want to get across to you guys. So pretty much I want you to ask yourself the question, what value does your health have in terms of a dollar amount? For example, um, what would you place in terms of value in money uh, that your health is worth to you? So pretty much what I'm trying to get at in this video is, is your health worth to you only say $20 a week? Is it worth $10 a week, $40 a week? How much money would you put in to invest into your health um, that makes it worth it to you, <clears throat> excuse me, in order to go to work out, to do a bit of fitness, to eat right? What is that dollar amount? Um, quite often, and, and this is, and I totally understand with finances and things like that, you have to do what works for you uh, and for your family and what you get given and have left over. But pretty much um, when it comes to fitness, what usually happens is people judge um, what they want to do by the price that it costs. So for example, if a gym costs $15 a week, $16, $17 a week, usually I think that's about the average, that's what you pay, um, and then you get access to equipment, and you go out and do your workouts. Now to some people, that's totally fine. Uh, to be honest, if you know what you're doing, if you know how to do things, if you don't need the support, unless you have your own personal trainer, go for it, do what you need to do. But quite often what I get um, and what I see all around, and this is just in the fitness industry in general, people trying to f shop around or look around for the absolute lowest price possible. Um, and what that does is you're, if you're trying to go for the absolute lowest price, there are places and facilities out there that may do everything for you for you know a super low price. But if you're wanting to really get the guidance, the coaching and the support in order to get you to your goal, usually you do pay a premium for that. And that's when it comes to and why I ask the question, how much is your health worth to you? You know, if you don't want to invest 10, 15, 20, 30 dollars a week into your health, um, what really is value does it have to you? Because if you're not willing to invest that much, um, especially when your health really is everything, um, it's something I'm quite passionate about. You've got to be healthy. If you want to enjoy life, do the things you want. You've got to have your health in check. Um, doesn't mean you have to be super fit or ripped or shredded or whatever, you know, in that side of things. You've just got to be optimal um, to your body, fit uh, enough to be able to play with your kids, um, support your family, go to places that you want to do, do hikes, do walks. Because the worst thing you can do is say you go on holiday, you go for a walk, you can't even finish it because you're out of breath and you just cannot keep up. Or if you want to do a mountain bike ride or anything like that. So how much is your health worth to you? Are you willing to invest 20, 30, 40, 50, $60 a week? Um, perhaps even including food to get where you want to be with your lifestyle and your health? Or are you willing just to shop around for the absolute lowest price you only want to spend $20 max, $15 max a week on your health and just get subpar results or not get the coaching and not get the support and not buy the right foods uh, in order to get you where you want to be. So that's why I just wanted to do this wee video. I want you to keep that question in your mind. Think on it a little bit. And like I said at the beginning of the video, it totally does depend on finances you know, what you bring into your household, what your income is on, you know, the free money that you can actually use towards uh, getting yourself into great shape and getting the fitness that you want. Because I do understand when it comes to fitness and eating right, it's not the cheapest thing out there. You know, if you want to go organic, you're going to pay a lot higher prices. Um, you know, if you want, if you want the best gym around, if you want PT, you know, personal trainer, five to six days a week, you know, you can really start getting up there in terms of price. You'll be well into the hundreds at that point, um, especially if you're doing a PT, depending on PT prices, of course, but averaging, you know, $40 to $60 for a, say, half-hour session, you're doing that five times a week, um, can really start to add up. Hence why 
typically most people would do a personal training session once twice a week and then just follow on with their own thing um, and that's good because you do have your own guidance you need some kind of guidance so that you have someone to ask if you need a little bit of help you know you're in the right direction and also if you've got your own nutritional coach all the map all the more power to you you know that's that's even better but once again it comes in with all that cost factor and pricing so don't let or don't try to think too small when it comes to your own health um, at the end of the day you get one body so invest what you can into it you know give yourself the best shot at where you want to be so if that means putting a little bit more money into it do that you know don't hold back like i said health affects everything um if you want to do something you've got to be you know something physical for example you've got to have that fitness if you want to feel confidence you know you've got to get your body into the right shape where you are feeling confident and that overall that takes some that takes either time it takes effort or it will take a little bit of money to get you the coaches access the equipment or the gear or for example like what we do we do um, group training so boot camps and things like that it totally depends on what you're going for and where you want to be with it but just keep that in mind just a video on that today just kind of want to touch on it uh, if you have any questions do let me know uh, we are running a 14 day kickstart program this coming monday for a super low 14 dollars so if you afraid to say if you cannot invest 14 dollars on yourself and you know you do have the time to uh to get to a few sessions a week and it's something you do want to do but you don't want to part with 14 dollars perhaps it's not the time for you at the moment um just wait till the future because you know, fourteen dollars is just getting you uh, to get you to put some skin in the game. If we do it free, everyone would have everyone sign up. Maybe half the people wouldn't turn up. If you've got a little bit of skin in the game, you know it gets you committed. It says, "Cool, I'm doing this, and I'm gonna you know try to get the best results I can in this uh, time period." So pretty much that starts next Monday. We're at just over three quarters full in terms of registration. So if you want to get in on it please um, either visit the link that I'll put into the comments or you can uh, send me a message. I'll put my email below in the comments as well if you've got any questions regarding it. But other than that, have an awesome evening. A little bit of a rant, I know, but hopefully it gets you thinking about it a little bit more. Cool. All right, have a good one.